I thought I'd take this opportunity of just introducing myself, really, just in one minute, uh, so you know who you're dealing with. My name is Steve. I had the privilege of being a Detective Chief Inspector in the Metropolitan Police in London. And uh, outside the UK, that's probably equivalent to about captain. Uh, on top of that as well, as I'm also a, a forensic psychologist. So I went to university halfway through my career and as a senior investigating officer and as a murder investigator, I thought the two together uh, would really, really work well. But that's enough about me. My job is to deliver the best possible talks that I can. And of course, the first one that I'm going to be doing, I do a lot of these, but on this particular platform, is called Women Who Kill. It's got to be, hasn't it, the ultimate taboo. Well, here in the United Kingdom, I've looked at how courts treat women charged with murder and uh, with serial killings. Are they treated fairly? Is there some sort of injustice? Who do women pick on? Uh, there is a stark difference between males and female uh, killers. And uh, that's something we can talk about. I'm also going to talk about some uh, really, really interesting cases. And the most bizarre one uh, that I saw, uh, I met a female killer in the United States. It was really, really weird. So what else do we do? We do the psychopathy of psychopaths, the psychology of aggression and violence, murdered or missing, the fine line between a missing person's case and a murder case, offender profiling. Right in the middle of that, I've got some original material from Jack the Ripper's case file, and you will get the opportunity to do a psychological profile of Jack, and I'm very proud of uh, inventing that. We do British uh, serial killers, and I've also been researching uh, recently the psychology uh, of gang culture and the rise of gang culture in the UK. Forget all that, my job is to give you a, an immersive, fun experience that takes you from A to B, and uh, you actually move on and learn something. And of course, you get the opportunity to talk to uh, a detective uh, and a bit of an academic that's actually done it. So I really, really uh, look forward to working with you, and thanks for listening to this.